Okay, here's a tried and true plant that is really underestimated. For a while they were being overused, but look at this. This, as a specimen, just as we have it here, is a spectacular plant. Agapanthus, way common lily of the Nile. Comes in lots of different colors nowadays. This is a medium purple, and they come all the way from white into an almost midnight blue. Spectacular plant. Use it as a specimen, just like we do here. Don't necessarily use them in a large grouping. They don't seem to look quite as good that way. Now, let me tell you one thing about Agapanthus. It is famous for attracting snails. You're going to say, oh my gosh, I don't want any of that in my garden. But there's a solution to the problem. Um, all you have to do, go down here, see the old leaves? As long as you pull out the old leaves, that slimy base will not accumulate and you will not have a problem with snails because that's where the snails live in all this old stuff. So again, I wouldn't stay away from this plant because of the snails. I would just make a point of keeping the base clean so the snails have no place to hide. Uh, great plant. I love it. Very good in the shade. It tolerates both shade and sun. Again, not too many plants do. I would highly recommend Agapanthus. I love them.